So Jackie, firstly, welcome to the Australian Flame and welcome to being an Australian. Can you tell us a little bit about your athletics career to date? Um, oh gosh, that, that, could be, <laughs> that could be a long one. Um, yeah, I mean, so I just started running when I was, you know, mostly, most people, 11 or 12 and um, just progressed from there through high school, college. I, you know, I always had those big dreams of going to the Olympics and, you know, as you do when you're younger, but a lot of times that's so far off and it's funny how now the closer I get, I'm like, wow, I'm actually one of those that actually make it, you know, those little kids that say they always want to run in the Olympics. So, um, yeah, I mean, yeah, it's cool. So, I, I mean, I guess I don't even know where to start. It's been so long. I've been running for 15 years. <laughs> well, you have some so, international experience from the World Indoor Championships with the U.S. team. Can you tell us about that? Yeah, so I went to World Indoors last year, and um, it was kind of a weak year because, or at least it sort of seemed like it was the Olympic year, so it was fun for me to get the opportunity to do that. Um, it was definitely really different racing overseas foreign athletes, I guess, um, since you're in a little bubble in the U.S. and you just always race Americans. Um, so it was always good, you know, it's always good to get that experience, and I made the final last year, I kind of squeaked in. Um, so, you know, so it's always good to make a final at a World Championships, even if, even if it might be a weak year. Um, so I'm just continually getting more experience, like this year racing a couple Diamond Leagues is definitely um, been the best experience, even, probably even more so than racing World Indoors last year. Tell us about the Australian link. Your mum is the Australian citizen. What was behind the decision to sort of transfer allegiance to the green and gold? Um, well, I always, I always wanted to run for Australia, so it wasn't really necessarily in my mind transferring. Um, when I came out of college and signed with Nike, I, you know, that was my first question. I want to run for Australia, and you know, most of the time, most of the people just advised me against it, and I was like, okay, well, you know, more people know about this sport and how it works in me so I was like okay I'll just do what I'm doing and run for the US. I guess it's easier and um, easier to just make that transition since I already live there. Um, but you know after this this past year or two running professionally I knew it was something that I wanted to do and so I figured why not why why would I wait if it's something what I wanted to do so um, yeah so I finally just did it. I did it you know a couple weeks before the USA Championships and just kind of a whirlwind since then and I'm really glad it, it worked out and um, yeah so I'm finally running for Australia the green and gold like I've always wanted and, and you know that was what I always wanted when I said in middle school I want to run for the Olympics I would I'd always say I wanted to run for Australia so you ran your a qualifying time in the 5,000 meters at the Paris Diamond League talk tell us about the journey from then and what your aspirations are heading into Moscow yeah I mean I was it was awesome relief getting into one of those perfect races where everything goes well and you just feel invincible and it doesn't even feel hard because um, throughout the beginning of this year I was struggling so much because it's really hard to chase standards especially in 5k's and especially when you know there's subpar um, quality and performance like um, competitors in the races so I was really lucky to get into Paris last minute and just kind of ride along everyone else running fast and um, so after that I knew I was most likely going to be chosen for, for Worlds, but um, so I've kind of just been training since then. I, I did the London Diamond League with that 3K, but that didn't go that well, so I'm just kind of focusing on next week and kind of just thinking of it as the, any other race, even though this has been my dream to, to compete for, you know, on a world stage, but um, also just thinking of it like any other race and any other day, any other practice. Yeah. Well, thanks, Jackie, and good luck. All right, thank you.